Yeah, what would you do? Cutscene, ooh. A pleasure to meet you, you and me, Augusty. So it was you who delivered one's treasure back to one, hmm? That's right. I yes, you and me, Augusty. Hmm. And you wish for a parade. Stop sitting like that. Um. Go on, man. Ask him. Uh... Come now, don't be shy. Isn't that gross when cats do that? Well, you and me, Augusty. Out with it now. We need your wand. <sighs> One's wand, man. Huh? What did you say? Oh, oh, dude, settle down. Gonna beat the shit out of you. That smell. Could it be? That's right, you of Yaldristi. He's not from our world. He's the one whose power freed me from my prison. What? You mean he broke his spell? This little boy? Not really, he just cried you on me. You understand what you're saying, Fairy? Once you defy him, there's no turning back. I know, I know, I know, but... But what precisely? Well, you know, he might be able to... It's not one's concern. You may not have the wand. Now be gone. Does that mean no wand, Mr. Derby? Looks like it. So we didn't use the red herring or anything? Like, oh look, we found your beloved red herring. Obviously that did not belong in so the scene whatsoever. What? You're talking real? Okay, I don't have to read. Something wasn't quite right about our royal friend. Broken hearted he is, or I'm broken headed. The king is? Lacking enthusiasm, it looked like. And because he's broken hearted, the whole kingdom's being dragged down with him. What are we waiting for? Let's go find the piece of heart he's missing. Blimey, you don't need much encouragement, do you? Oh, okay. No more hearing the dialogue. What? Why? I don't get it. Okay. The guy outside the town is short of enthusiasm too, huh? Indeed he was, Ollie boy. Like I say, I reckon the king's broken oddedness is dragging everyone else down with him. But the other guard gave us enthusiasm to help his friend. Should we go back and ask him for some more? No, 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 Mun. Don't, don't go doing that. It's a very imp important rule about borrowing pieces of pe people's hearts. There, there is. What is it? Well, you can't go taking the same piece of heart from the same person twice. See, so I'll, one little scoop of the top is all it's safe to borrow. Borrow. Gee, I don't. I didn't know that. I'll be sure to be real careful from now on. So, what do we do now, Mr. Drippy? Retrawl back to some of the end of the. Plenty of sleepy place. Blah blah blah. Be somewhere there. The only problem is where Ding Dong Dell is not exactly a w village, exactly village size after all. You might even say it's proper massive. Guess it's kind of. I guess it kind of is, huh? Something about something of quandary, are we? Oh. Okay. Hi, Mr. Tellingstone, you creepy fucker. Seem perplexed about my young friends. I, I thought you might benefit a dose of my experience, expensive knowledge. Expensive knowledge, whatever. Thanks, that's real nice of you. You see, we need to borrow a piece of somebody's heart, but we don't know how to find one. Hmm. Elementary, my Oliver, dear Oliver. In places like this, you just look to your locket. Um, how do you mean? Well, not only can it carry pieces of a heart, the locket is also extremely sensitive to proximity. It will glow to someone nearby. Tiny, all we do is use that to track down some enthusiasm, ain't it? Bring in a little more of the locket of yours. Oh, I see, and the medium map shows green light. Okay, thanks. You don't need to tell me anymore. Is it not like the pieces of a heart with spare and the glow of green, blah, 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 pieces of your screen? Neato, huh, really? Blah, blah, blah. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm tired of this. <laughs> oh, magic. Oh, oh. Kind of appears like that and jumps into me. To examine the spare, shall we? If you all lock it, shows them we'll be traveling back. Alright, whatever. So we just find some enthusiasm. Save. Okay, let's head down there. Oh yeah, I got that necklace for the cat or whatever. Here you are. Ah, oh, you've got it. Oh, it's perfect. Just perfect. You found it for me. You sure did. D don't go lose it again, okay? I promise I'll never lose it again. Oh, here. This is a present for you. Thank you so much. A leafy mantle. Oh, well, it's something. Alright, two merit stamps. Huh. Okay, I guess I can start by... Can you equip it? I guess not. Can I equip it? No, I guess not. Then what the fuck's the point of me having a leafy mantle if I can't fucking equip it? Oh well. Oh, it's a cloak. I can't equip a cloak? I guess I already have one. <laughs> oh well. Uh, did I have another completed errand? I wasn't sure. I haven't been doing errands. Uh, nine stuff, two missing children. Oh, I need to find missing children. That's right. I guess I should do this. It looks like it shows them on the map there, maybe. There's one left, yeah. Yeah. Hey, staircase. Oh, there. Ah. This is a, oh, it's the missing child. Oh, well, there he is. Yeah, whatever. Have this, you crybaby. Take this! Oh, wait, no, it's a healing spell. Oh, it's not hurting. It's not hurting anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, there's tidy blah blah blah. Please. Yes, Mr. Wizard, I will. Yeah. Was that the last kid? What the? It's a purple chest. It seems to be sealed by some very potent magic. Oh, okay. Obviously, you're too much of a chump to try and do it now, so, uh, yeah, idiot. Do I have the right controller in just a sec? I'm trying to... Analogs real hard. I don't, but it will do. <laughs> the analog just feels really worn. It's one of my old controllers. Last missing child. There's still one more, one more child? What's well, not that one. What's well, in the journal? Those uh, cat people called Grimalkin. Grimalkin. Wasn't that from... Yeah, I remember them being called that in Blaze Blue Calamity Trigger. <laughs> Kind of a funny reference right there, if anyone ever played the game. They were cat people as well. Grimalkin. Is this some Japanese thing? Nah, yeah, I don't think I've gotten any of your plants, bitch. Oh, I'll find that missing child elsewhere. As long as he doesn't croak, I think we're fine. Just want to continue the story a little. What the fuck? Cutscene. Ooh. It glows. Look, Mr. Jerpy, the locket, it's glowing. Tidy, there's someone around here with a piece of heart to spare, ain't it? Uh, gee, is it this only little child with a pot helmet? And the only person around here is him. And look at him, man. <laughs> look at him, man. He barely can stand still. He's so eager. Jackpot. You mean he's... You think he has some enthusiasm to spare? That I do. That I do, my lad. I bet my lantern on it. Let's go get it, shall we? Hey, are those two strange strangers talking about me? Uh, what the? How do? Was that sauce pan head? Oh, that's what Drippy's saying. How nice. <laughs> I don't suppose you have fancy doing us a favor, do you? Hey, stop distracting me. I'm busy. Busy? Uh, what are you doing? What are you busy doing exactly? Protecting the town from mice, of course. Mice? Oh yeah, I remember hearing about that mice who lived in Ding Dong Dell. Those mice are a menace. They're always running around getting up and no good. But the grown-ups are too lazy to do anything about it. 
Most of them hardly notice when they when the mice steal things, and the ones that do, and the ones that do, do don't seem to care. Well, Tommy Stout is not going to stand for it. I know the mice all live down in the well, so I'm standing guard here. Any mice that comes up in the way is in for a battering. <laughs> well, well. We we were right about this one. He's bursting with enthusiasm. Over over to you, Ollie boy. Uh, what are you talking about? Well, King Tom seems to be really short on enthusiasm right now. And we're, that's where you come in, my <laughs> where you come in, Tommy boy. You've got loads of the stuff. We've got we've got to give it some to King, but whatever. Quick and shut. Yeah. So we were wondering if you could spare some of your enthusiasm with us. Of course, I'll I do anything to help the king. Thanks, Tommy. I'll steal it from you. Arrgh, Mortal Kombat Cabal chest rip out. Oh, it's just a light. Well, that's not gory at all. Fucking not entertaining. What the hell is this? The flaming passion of enthusiasm. Wow, that was strange. Well, I don't know. I, I now I know what magic feels like. Strange, what do you mean? Non wizarding types ain't used to spells, you see, Ollie boy. They don't know what it's like to make them ha make them half the time. So does this mean King Tom's going to be right about Oliver? Yes, and once once the king is back to normal everyone else should start feeling better too. That's right, man, your enthusiasm going to put a spring in everyone's step, ain't it? It's great to hear until then, until then, though I'd better si I'd better stay here and keep an eye out for out, of, out for the mice. I can't read today. I can't read any day, as a matter of fact. Alright, see you later, Tommy. <laughs>